Uh, Chris Chinock here for Insight Media. I'm here with these guys, uh, PS Holographics from Germany, it looks like, AG. <laughs> yeah, Switzerland. Okay, close. <laughs> uh, we're showing a super multi-view display here. Uh, so this is uh, basically a, a lenticular display uh, that they have here. Um, it's, it is multi-zonal, so you, if you go left to right, you will go through the zones. Uh, and this is based on a, uh, a 4K panel, and the 3D image is about uh, full HD resolution, so kind of typical of, of this class of display. Uh, what's different about this company is that the number of views they create. Uh, so this is 14,000 views, 28,000 views. I'm sorry, 28,000 views. Uh, and each view uh, only uses about 50 pixels. Uh, it's horizontal parallax only, uh, so it does create a very smooth image. Uh, obviously, my camera is not going to capture the, the depth here, um, but what's uh, it's about plus or minus uh, so maybe two inches or so uh, for the depth volume, uh, which is it, it's decent for this class of display. Um, they're here ta talking mainly to uh, automakers. Uh, so it, interested in center consoles such as this, uh, where instruments might pop out or warnings might pop out or give a little perspective on this on this map. Again, as you can't really see this on the on the video that I'm capturing here, but uh, that's what's uh, what's was visible and and of course uh, you can do uh, avatar as well. Um, the company can take take uh, uh, stereo content and convert it to their 28,000 view format. Uh, it does take some processing, obviously, in a computer to do this. Uh, they'd like to be able to put that into uh, an FPGA at some point. Uh, and another application they've talked about here is this uh, stereo camera. Uh, again, for an automotive application, uh, this could be for the, the backup camera or the side mirror, uh, both of which would be very beneficial to give that stereo uh, content, uh, again, to be converted to the, to the multi-view displays here. So that's pretty much the story. Uh, Chris Chinock for Insight Media.